Everybody's talking about 3i Atlas, the interstellar comet, but nobody's talking about the other visitor that's lighting up our skies right now. And this one actually belongs here. <laughs> Meet Comet Swan, officially C2025R2 Swan, discovered in September by NASA's SOHO spacecraft using its solar wind anisotropies instrument. So what makes it different than 3i Atlas? Well, Atlas came from the deep interstellar void and it's never gonna return. Swan, however, it was born here. A long period comet pulled in from the Oort cloud, the icy boundary of our solar system out past Pluto. Uh, its orbit is bound to the sun, which means it will come back someday, just probably not for thousands of years. Uh, scientists estimate Swan's nucleus, the solid core, is roughly one to two kilometers wide. It's wrapped in a glowing coma of gas and dust stretching thousands of kilometers across. It's smaller and cooler than 3i Atlas, but it's closer. Your best chance to catch it is just after sunset low on the western horizon, especially for southern hemisphere sky watchers. Bring binoculars or a telescope and look for a faint hazy streak in the twilight. Two travelers, two stories, one far beyond the stars, the other was born in our own backyard. Let's keep watching the skies. I'll keep you updated as information comes out. Stay curious and stay grounded.